Hello, and we are live. Uh, I don't know how this playback, and I haven't done the Discord alert. Why the hell is my charge so low? It was on 82 seconds ago. Why is it on two? Um, hello, Chris. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Oh boy, I had nothing up today because I'm late. And today is switch day. Well, not switch day. Um, and yeah. So we're streaming switch day. I had nothing set up ten minutes ago, so I was rushing. Yes, Pokemon. They did. Yes, I was completely rushing today. Trying to get everything ready as quickly as possible. Oh shoot, why is that? Um why is it where's the police? Where's the police? Uh oh, this isn't great. Uh everything I put you I'm on the floor somewhere. Um Oh, this is irritating. Turns out I wasn't ready at all today. Um, I thought I was. But evidently not. Uh, where the heck did that go? Yeah. I need to try and find that. So, you go first. I can't tire of it. Um, I'm panicking. Um, I am going to be. Pokemon to answer your question, there is a lot left, so yeah. Where is it gone? Oh, Christ. That's right. how I feel. Uh, right, I'm gonna go try and find it.
We found it. We found it. Okay, so now, seven minutes into the stream, I can do my intro. Okay, so I do still need to do this call ping. want you why did you open we're almost there we are only nine followers away um it's what is it today So, finally, I can say, how are we all today? Nope. How are we all today? Oh. Oh, we're back. We're back, finally. Okay. I say we just get straight into the gaming today, because already 10 minutes in, I don't need to get started in. So, where'd it go? There it is, why is it so big? Could all be this? It's yes, there we go. Why is it on news? I don't read news. But yes, we are here today. Pokertastically happy, yes. Indeed. So, um, is Chris still here? Or has Chris left to go do stuff? BC, yes. Yes. Just yes. Uh, where is the VC? Stream VC. There we go. Oh, so much panic today. Honestly. <sighs> okay. So, just half an hour ago, I had nothing set up. So, I was just rushing. Wait, still have my eyes. I, I added it back because I lost it. And it stopped working. So, I added it back. So, yeah. That's still a thing. Okay. So, I say... Sound isn't working, which is fantastic. Hi. Hello. Sorry, I, I couldn't hear you over the music because I didn't realize you you had unmuted. So I was just sitting there listening to music, like I wonder how long it's gonna take for him to get this started <laughs> out. And then I started realizing, oh wait, he's already unmuted. <laughs> Look, some of this spy is very loud. Okay. Yeah. Now I've got to figure out why the sound on it isn't working. Controllers. Do you know what I do? My things are low in charge. What? I scream at them. Oh, I normally do that. Just like I can't really do that on stream. True. <laughs> and the sound isn't working, which is really annoying. Agreed. Um. Oh, I think sound is working now. <laughs> Can you make me a promise? I can try. Don't look at my tweets. Deal? Deal. Deal. <laughs> Deal. <laughs> Good, great. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Just turn off notifications for my Twitter. Okay? Yeah. yeah. Perfect. Hopefully the sound is working. Fingers crossed. Uh, I don't know. I have the stream muted, so you have to ask for Pokemon? Is the sound working? Because I can hear it, but I'm just not sure if you can. Oh, there goes my controller. My controller died. Oof. Now I've got to I run downstairs and get my other pair. So I'm going to run downstairs and get my other pair of controllers. Okay, because okay. I, I'm going to cry. I'm so. Alright, I will see you in a minute. 
if you hear me falling down the stairs, just like stream won't be able I to really hear want it. To be like, but if you can hear me fall, falling down, down the stairs, just camp, I'm good, so. probably. Seconds. Are you sans? Are you sans? Are you sans? Oh no. I'm fully out of breath. Oh my house has the rule, be careful because people are running indoors. <laughs> that looks so wrong. That just looks so wrong. I'm gonna go check something. I'll be right back. Blue and, blue, and, blue and yellow just looks so wrong. Oh. Okay. Is the sound synced? Do we know? I'm out of breath. That is all I can say. That weird combination, I hate it so much. Hello. How are you today? Glad to see we're already so early on and we get new people. Where am I? Oh, right. So, I've caught every Pokemon. Now I just need to complete the deck entries for all of them. So I can shiny hunt because I want to do that in this game. Hi, sorry. I was rushing. Mike! 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 That was loud. Sorry, I was just checking that I can go into a different room. Alright. Let me just turn. Okay. Um, Sleepy, how's everyone? I'm decent. Go for it. Sort that. I'll sort it for probably let next stream. Tortured, let me go get the tortured lo lo lollipop. Uh, I like the lollipop. Yeah. So in here I have all the legends of the game in the game, all the legends in the game. I also have every single unknown. I caught every single one in the same day. It was hell. And I also have all of my alphas in these two boxes. So yeah, I have a lot of duplicates. Well, I'm pretty sure I have about three Steelix. Two, two Steelix. Nice. Welcome back. Yeah. So I do need to re-catch a couple of Pokemon, which is going to be irritating. Right. Turn that down for me. Hopefully that isn't too quiet for you. Okay, so um, I do need to catch another Cyndaquil, which will be irritating, as well as the Oshawa. Um, but... Is Mustard an instrument? I could do the majority. Because I did use the Pokemon Home gift also, on us to get the... Um, I didn't get a chance to say this, but hello, Aaron Sully. Yes. I need to say hello. Yes, so I have all the Pokemon Home gift ones with perfect IVs in here. Love that. Still up. Um, so yeah. So I'm probably going to go to the Alabaster Icelands. The Icelands.
because I'm pretty sure that. To be fair, I've only played a small part of Legends, so. Nice. Um, you'll you'll have fun with the post game. I struggled quite a bit with it. That's all I'm gonna say. My brother's finished the entire game plus the story. Oh, oh I forgot about the evil. I forgot about the evolutions. Yeah, my. Oh, I forgot about all the evolutions. Ignore the fact that I've got um, only shinies for Jolteon and Flareon. Pokemon, um, maybe don't ask, to like ask for follows, that's my job. Um, yeah. You got your Pokedex done? Nice. Ignore the fact that I've only got Jolteon and Flareon on Shinies, because I just transferred in, transferred them in from Shield and I've got hat Shinies of them both, so you know. I am! Because I'm not going to sit there and evolve so many Eevees. Sylveon. I have a lot of my. I have four of my um, Pokemon Go shinies in here. I just realised that I have 69 hours of playtime in Legends. So I'm gonna mute on stream to eat, and also probably turn my microphone off so you can't eat, see me eating. So, yeah. Your microphone off so you can't see you eating. Excuse. <laughs> yep. Yesterday I got a shiny. I just watched your profile. I just watched your profile picture disappear into nothingness as it loaded into Pokemon Legends. For, uh, Summer is December, January. Huh? Didn't hear you, Bobby. Your mic glitched out. 
Oh yeah, yeah. I'm talking to I'm talking to Jens. <laughs> January, February, March, and April, May, June, July, August, September, October? What can I do with this one with that? October, November, December.
was like exactly the same as that with Pokemon. Like, I found a back of the park in the house and I was just like, oh, I wish there was more though, because I don't know if there's a lot of people that have been there. Yeah, I'm just going to go back and get the Pokemon in the back of the park. Drift on these controllers is annoying. That's the problem with the very first versions of the Switch. Like you've got as well with your uh, adapter for the TV, so you can do it to the TV, you can do the screen of your Switch. So be careful with that. Okay. Um, I didn't understand any of that. Bruh. This very first version of Switch scratches screen when you put it in here. Okay. And also the drifting on the controllers is a problem with the first version of the Switch. Okay. So getting you good. Um this Yeah. I had a look at my um, schedule for streaming, um, I think two days ago, and then I messaged Mike saying I can kind of become a paper streamer, because I've got four like stream series going at the moment, and like, three of them are Pokemon, but four stream series that are going to be happening. I've got technically five, and three of them are uh, Pokemon, so you know, slowly become a paper streamer. Stream by stream. Trying to come up with like variety, but it's difficult. <laughs> exactly. So that's why I'm so fixated on trying to get affiliate. <laughs> exactly.
it, it had a website name. So I changed it. Well, I didn't change it. I just like Google nicknames for bait for flaring on them. Yeah, I just put the first one I saw because I had a website name. I never took it on the screen one day. Why did I throw both ball at it? You have a massive thing. Seven more evolutions that I've got to do. Oh my god, I'm having garlic bread for dinner tonight.
change all the time. But at the moment, my th three favourite are Hoi Pol is Hoi Pol was my um, last favourite Pokemon. Uh, no, it was my last second favourite Pokemon. My first favourite Pokemon ever played was with the same Pokemon. But yeah, my three favourite at the moment would be Inkay, Drifloon, and Furfru. Because...
time because I don't read. I was gonna go with the legendary birds as well. Yeah. Oh my god, my friend is calling me. Yeah. be cheap so I can't afford it. <laughs> yeah. I'd like to have like the authentic Gen 5 authentic Gen 5 vibe because I haven't played a Gen 5 game. So if I get the Gen 5 remakes that I started with, like, I started with a random Roblox game. Same. 
insane. They... Another thing that reminds me, yeah, I was just about to say something like that, like I think it was year 4 where I had this like teacher and like any time that like my class couldn't get something right she always looked at me and just went just tell us what it is, like standing really like deflated, like all year for the whole year every time my class can get something just like tell us what you did and then I can remember I think it was year 6 as well, yeah.
I've seen it. <laughs> and... I think it's okay. It's okay at the best. Yeah, because, like... Do you want to know what's kind of irritating me? I'm just having a look at um, all like streams on Legends Arceus, Legends Arceus, and there is almost there mo most of the streams are different Pokemon games, which is really annoying. Like, I get why they do it if they're playing a fan game. Like most of them are just play, like playing black or white or sword and shield. Like some people who like to say on the stream like for um, the viewers, 
some, some of them don't even, oh, oh, Alpha Eevee, um, some of them don't even, like, have Arceus, which is even more annoying. Oh, this Alpha Stream title says, um, like Sword and Shield Dynamax Adventures or whatever. So, yeah. Just a little rant and something that kind of annoyed me. But, on a better note, we're on five viewers. Oh, no. But on the, on the brighter side, we're on five viewers. I might beat up the Alpha Rapidash to get revenge for all the pain it's given me. Yeah. Yeah. I, f I, I beat a lot of quests while I was filling my decks. That's how I got that um, shiny Poetar as well. I got that from the quest.
do it again. Discussing our favorite mods. Oh. So, there was a specific part of the deal that included not sending it to me. Why worry about grammar when you're not in school? I mean, like, while you're messaging. If you're not in the school building, why worry about grammar? Thank you. 
to. Yeah. And you just said, hey, I don't want to call you, so can I just call you Jelly? And I was just like, oh my god, yeah, I love that. genuinely thought you died for a second. Thrust it through the screen. Yeah. It's like, 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 like smash it into the screen because I like take the water. <laughs> and it just spews out my camera. Yeah, I mean, like, like one of those Donald Duck plushes that just like start making noise when you shake it. And I'm just scared. Alright. <laughs> That's why I don't laugh. <laughs> don't, don't be happy. Look at 
Loco, loco. green shards I mean you're right Caught one Abra. Why does that sound so much like a girl? Oh my god. So. <laughs> I'm scared. <laughs> Now William Afton kills the children. I just kidnap them. Cause that makes everything better. If I just kidnap the children. Stop. 
stop speaking. Stop speaking. Excuse me. Be quiet, stop speaking. Stop me, just go burn next hour. No, it's all run away. No. No. <laughs> What? What? Wait, no. Oh, I heard I heard the shiny sound. No, is that a shiny abra? Is that a shiny freaking abra? Please don't say it. It's a shiny abra. I said I said I said, I said to it. Chris, I might cry, it's a shiny Abra. Chris, help. It's a shiny Abra. I don't do well with Abra. No, 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 I scared it off. Oh, please say, please say that it's still here. I did save it. No, you can't forget something you never had. Oh my god, I'm terrified. That is my entire 
I need this, I need this, I need this. Please, it's my first legitimate shiny. I scared it off, but I saved, so it should still be here. Oh, it's still here, it's still here, thank god it's still here. Oh, I hit it, I hit it with a backstrike. No, shut up, sorry, I need you to shut up for this. I caught it. Yes! Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Someone clip that right now. Pokemon, I needed to clip that, my reaction. Hopefully you get the whole thing on there, hopefully, because I want the reaction and me catching it. But I, but I want, I need to, I need to post that clip on my YouTube. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's the first legitimate, no, 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 no. It's the first legitimate shiny I've found in any Pokemon game. Yes, please. <laughs> I'm sorry, I, I just... Um, it's, 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 it's I need to message Mike. I need to brag to Mike. Good. Um. I'm going to fully evolve this. <laughs> I'm, re I'm ready to listen to you now, just because I, all that panic's over now. It still exists! It still exists! Shiny Ambro. <laughs> yeah. I'm so glad I did that. Look at that. Look how beautiful that is. I'm keeping my shiny child in my party until the end of time. I'm kind of busy, mate. What do you want? Look, look, Mike. Look at that. Look at that. I didn't kill it, it ran away. Leave me alone. I'm giving it every single marking. Cool, cool. I'm so proud of myself. You know what? I'm gonna record a TikTok. Just give me a sec to record a TikTok about this. Yeah, cause you haven't been posting TikTok. Wait, you haven't marked yourself, yeah? <laughs> Why is the first TikTok I got on my For You page, POV, you're rich? I'm gonna take my headphones out because I can't hear you and the TikTok's not gonna hear you. Okay, goodbye for a second. You're gonna hear me recording it by the way. Both you and chat. Actually no, I'm not gonna let chat hear me. Only you can hear me, Chris. Um, because, um, wait, what, what do the marks do? Absolutely nothing, Mike.
Hey chat, I'm back. I just gotta upload that real quick. No, why is the sound on? Why? Shiny Abra on stream. Bye, Mike. There we go. My garlic bread. I'm so proud of that. And I, huh? Poor new people who are just getting their like one. Why are they taking a bunch of I don't understand either chat, don't worry. Right, I'm keeping this in my um I'm keeping this in my pie and fully evolving it right now. I cannot, no, I'm sorry, this is a big deal for me. Shiny Avril. Why is the controller not working? Shut up. I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry. Back. You never said to me, gone Pokemon. Pokemon, were you here for the Shiny Avril? Just, hang on, I'm sorry, just one second, please, just one second. I need to note down that time so I can come back and clip it after this dude. Power now. But yeah, we caught a shiny Abra while you were gone. Command for newest shiny Pokemon. that the shiny like sprite doesn't show up in the decks yet which is really annoying mm. uh, oh, oh. 
Wait, no, never mind. It's a palm. It don't show up. Do I need no? I don't know. I don't know. first shiny that I found in Legend of Arceus or any other Pokemon game. My only- <laughs> My only other shinies were either, um... Oh! Thank you for the raid! Hey! Thanks for the raid! How was your day? How did- what, what did you stream? Did you stream? Did you do yes. Thank you for the follow. I'm gonna turn that off so I can actually Yes, well played. That was just really. Thank you. Got it. It is. I see you on the other It wasn't desktop audio that it's turned down. Because the Elgato is a completely different thing, which is cool. But yeah, is that better? I like half it. But yeah, so, how was your stream? What did you stream? Let me just check. I'm not sure if this works. Doing a hardcore Nuzlocke. On Blaze Black 2. That's a Tronky bit, yes. I see you trying to complete the decks, yes. Let me see if this works. It should, but I don't know. Shoot, it didn't work. I tried to set that up, but it didn't work. Yes, and you. I do. I'm gonna see if I can get that working. Chunky. But yes, you just. Assuming you need to Twitch? No, we're not actually. Just, I never really got commands working properly. So we have that issue. Um but for me and Jensen have been on the platform for quite a while. Yeah. But yeah, so how did your Nuzlocke go? How far in the game did you get? Have you lost any mons? Because I'm also, bad at Nuzlocke's. Because of the fact that you keep saying the word mate, I'm assuming um, that you're like Australian or Kiwi. So I want to know like if that goes. What is that voice? Oh, that would be me. I'm the second ever moderator to moderate his streams. A lot of prep from Portal Battles. I do see that. That might be why I'm bad at those locks because I don't prep. Because I don't prep. It's really confusing. Who's the Excuse underage? Excuse you. <laughs> underage sounding voice. Just because my voice is high pitched doesn't mean I sound sound young. Listen, do I sound really young? Yeah. <gasps> A 
Um, but yeah, so you just missed us catching an Abra, really a shiny Abra. Do I really sound that high pitched? Yeah. Oh my god, it did sound really up. Oh my. Oh. oh, I thought it was a bot that could reach out. No. But yeah, you just missed us. Like a bot. You just missed us catching a shiny Abra. First ever legitimate shiny in any Pokemon game. I'll glad you guys know that I can just sign off. I can just sign off for the night. It's, it's 11:52 in, in the afternoon. I can I can just close my laptop, go over to my room, and go to sleep. You could, but you're Honestly, not going to. If I didn't have sleeping, if I didn't have sleeping problems, that would be preferred. I could do that. A box that has mastered tone. A box that has mastered tone. I can. Uh, uh, I I I have not mastered tone. I am autistic. Quite faint. Oh. Uh, I am. I could do that. See if that works. Maybe that might yeah. be too loud. We'll see. Are you on Discord? We are. I did turn it up a bit. Yeah, we are. That might be a bit too loud, though. But yeah. Is I will try and get the shout out command working for any future raids. So hopefully I can sort that out. Gotta love audio issues. Gotta love we audio do. issues. Yep, gotta love audio issues. We do. Um, I'll use Adios. One time I rec one time I was recording an, ent an entire half an hour of Ultimate Custom Night content for a video. And for like 28 minutes of it, my mic was so low to um, on my headphones that you could not hear a single word I said. The entire duration of the video. Thank you for the follow. Thank you for the follow. <laughs> I, I am experiencing massive brain rot right now. Um, what do we need to do? <laughs> that sounds like something I would say, Pokemon. Alright, man, first I have to head off. It's late. I didn't get up. I just wanna. Um, I have. I'm getting the feel. I'm getting a. Uh, thank you for wishing us. Thanks a for the raid as well. I'm getting the feeling that you're um Australian or Kiwi because you keep saying mate. Mm. But yeah, have a have yeah, a see nice. You. Uh, thank have you nice for the raid again. Have a nice sleep, or whatever, you, or wherever you're going to head off to. Um. Uh, don't get up too early. Uh, I suffer from doing that a lot, and it really hurts my like sleeping. So make sure that if you're getting up early, that you don't get up so early that you'll lose a lot of sleep from it. I mean, I'm Australian and I keep saying, mate. Yeah, I know. It's just my first thing since, since I'm also Australian. Yeah. Ain't brain rot like an actual condition? One that would logically hosp hospitalize you? I don't know. I am not studying in any, like, nursing field. Although in Indonesia, it's close to Australia. Is it? Is it? I, I don't know geography. I don't know. Look, I'm, wa look, I'm waterlocked. We're waterlocked, okay? I do not know a single thing about geography except for the fact that Americans are so narcissistic that whenever they make fla they they make maps, they put them in the center. So we were just like Uno reverse, and then we did that for our maps by putting us in the center. Yeah. No, I wasn't meant to play. I'm not even kidding. My, my my teacher mentioned that. My teacher mentioned seven that. followers left. Seven followers left. Yep, seven yeah. seven 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 followers. Seven seven. Oh, until affiliate. Seven follows until affiliate. Yeah. You can see over there, I think it might be. That way. Oh, a little follow goal. It's in top right. Yeah. Hopefully that is still correct. Because it has a habit of being wrong. Yeah, because you're constantly moving things. No, he's right. You did point in the right direction, though. I did? I'm good. Oh, the streamling just caught up with it. America is in the top left corner of an American map. It is? 
Also, my teacher said that, that um, Americans put their put put America around the center. They might like, they don't that, like change like its height, but they change like but they put it in like that like the middle of the map. So Australia did an Uno reverse and put us in the middle of the map for our maps. Because there's a giant map in the back of our room, and Australia is in the center. Still the bottom, but I feel like every country does that though. Just like put themselves in the middle of the map. Because mm. to phrase it how my teacher phrased it, well, it because line. because America is so like self-centered, like they they put themselves in the middle. Well, I'm American and I know that's near the top top one on the far left. That's how it is for our maps too, actually. Uh, I didn't mean to offend anyone, I was just saying what my teacher said. My life is a lie. <laughs> I mean, fair. I didn't mean to offend anyone. It's just like a funny stereotype that I like to repeat. Also because I have been mistaken for American. A lot of times, my father likes to n has nicknamed me the American. Forever, basically. Is because of my accent, and whenever I join calls, I I, I hear the phrase, "Oh look, it's an American." What the hell is the people in other countries? Which annoys me because I am an Indigenous Australian. As an Indigenous, you like to criticize Americans? Do you eat burgers all the hell is he, is he teaching people in other countries? Um. They definitely teach different things in different countries. The I first think. fleet. The first fleet, the fact that we stole parts of the British government and the American government to create our own government because we cool like that. The fact that the people that, that that people thought that Tasmania was actually connected to the main island of Australia and it was called Van Diemen's Land. The the history of the states slash colonies, the joining together of them and the fact that I think it was um Queensland or something or South Australia or something wanted to be slick unique and didn't want to join in with the others until like, later on and a lot of other Australian history things that I've spent months and months and years and years learning that I just condensed down in like two seconds my my te my teacher 10 years ago said Americans always had a, has a shotgun in their house well nah, not really but it's surprising a lot yeah. It's it's just that funny stereo it's just well not funny, but it's like it's that stereotype that like school shootings like America. Because yeah. cause for those who don't know, Australia had one school shooting and our government reacted big time by like going full heavy down to protect schools from that happening again. And then you have I'm assuming fake, I hope fake. Target ad where they're using target supplies where kids are using target supplies to help themselves in a school shooting. Mm. And it's America. Oh, and it's kind of Pokemon Day Century. <laughs> and, like, Pokemon, can you please stop giving us, like, yeah. hints? I'd rather this. go in blind, to it's, be honest. Th that's what I keep saying, too. You did it in another streamer's chat, but I like to read it. Yeah. It's nice. I baited him into it, yeah. and then he started doing it to death chat. Even though he doesn't even play Pokemon, he plays Mario games and the Soul, like the Demon Souls games and that. I mean, it's nice every now and then to get like small. I hidden. mean, America did a American American excuse me, ADHD here. Um, I I mean that's how it's written, but yeah, did help us in World War Two. We still don't believe believe you because. Because y'all have these Karens all, all around America. Yeah, I haven't met a single Karen IRL. About 40% of American, um, 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 Americans, 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 <laughs> Americans carry arms and arms. I don't know that sounds very weird. Like, just imagine carrying a human arm with you. And I'm pretty sure the majority are Republican, not all the majority. I have no political knowledge, insight, or view. Politics is not my thing. What level and does Apple evolve? If something, if something, if somebody mentions politics and it doesn't have something to do with Trump, I have, or like Obama, I have, or like one of our like prime ministers, I have no clue whatsoever what they're talking about. <laughs> I was just about to read the same message twice because I thought it was a different one. I'm not a fan of politics either. Yeah, not really my thing per se. I'm the person who 
ever since they were five has wanted to be a YouTuber, and ever since they started their channel has always dreamed of it being a job and it wasn't and it wasn't those sappy stories of I started as a hobby and now it's my career. Oh, love that. Yeah, no. I wanted to chase that bag the easiest way possible. By uploading gotcha videos and animations and gaming gaming clips until I until I became rich and famous. <laughs> it's the strat Yeah. I'm probably gonna end up having to get a part-time job as a fast food person or something until I manage to get that ball rolling. Joe Biden starts with a Joe. Sorry, that was a corny, corny joke. I, I shall go and commit existential crisis. No, no, it's fine. I make those jokes all the time. <laughs> Here's what I love. If K stands for OK and Pop stands for Grandpa, does that mean K-Pop stands for OK Boomer? Laugh with me, or I look stupid. <laughs> that was loud. Oh. That's all I can say to that. <laughs> it was. It wasn't really that loud. I love the way that we got a raid and now chat is like constantly new messages. I would love having chats like that because it's never like a dull moment on the stream. You're always talking about something new. Well, it well, I mean, if well, I mean, in the streams where you don't let, they don't let me VC with you, that's how the chat is, because I'm, I talk a lot, but yeah. yeah, I'm actually really interested what you guys are thinking about Americans in other places. Apparently, there's like American food dolls with this weird, disgusting, over fatty, sugar, unhealthy, gross food. Can you guys start putting like commas in your big essay texts? <laughs> Because I have ADHD and I'm having trouble reading these without literally putting my finger against my laptop screen to keep my line placement. There are a lot of those in India, uh, Indonesia. Uh, cool. Uh, <laughs> I don't start, yeah. Apparently, Americans don't have, like, Tim Chams. Apparently, that's an Australian thing. And, like, Milo. And also, I have ADHD and I use commas most of the time. Yeah, it just makes my life a whole lot easier. We really, really judge you a lot because we care about our country helpers' opinions. Just the awkward silence. A TF is a Tim Tam, like a Tic Tac. No, it's not a Tic Tac. It's like a rectangular, like, chocolate snack. And it's really, really yummy. And it's super like yummy, and if you like bite off the top and bottom, and then it's like like half dunk it into a milk and suck, because of like the air bubbles, you can like drink the milk through the Tim Tam, and it makes it kind of chocolatey, and they're really yummy. I hate Tim Tam. You are not welcome in Australia. I love them. Anyways. Excess roll mm. I'm I'm joking, by the way. I'm joking. Don't have any just, if you you can have your opinion on food, but if you but if you want, I you can have your uh, opinion I, I, on food unless it's garlic bread, where you must love it. Yes, if you do not like garlic bread, I will come to your house and I will shove garlic bread down your down your ear hole. <laughs> Excuse and then me. I'll, and then all you will hear is garlic bread. All, all you will hear is garlic bread for the next two months. It's just too sugary. Sugary. Excuse you. Well, to be honest, in different places they're okay, made now, different now ways. I just want Tim Tams. Like different places, You're they do use sugary. different like um, recipes in different places. So yeah. that might be. If it. you come to Australia, try like the actual Tim Tam. <laughs> Apparently, you guys have a version of Maltesers that is not like a Malteser at all. Why? Maltesers are like. I don't know how to describe the center, and then it looks like they're covered in chocolate. And it's just like so good. I love Maltesers. And then your guys' version are so bad and not like Maltesers at all. Oh. Also, apparently, um, here's a lesson to all of the people who do not know how to eat Vegemite. Since Vegemite is yeast and salt, it is very, very strong. So what you have to do is put a light amount of it on a piece of bread and make a, and make a sandwich. 
You might think the light amount will mean that it's not enough, but trust me, I just hit something. Trust me, it is more than enough. Just don't eat you it like think it's about this it like I hate these videos that make Americans look like super dumb, and they can't put a scrolling on the map, and they don't know what, what content is, because we're not like dumb, I swear. I mean, I believe that not all of them are that yeah, dumb, but there's yeah. definitely some that are definitely dumb. Yeah, there are definitely some people who are dumb, but I'm not saying all Americans are dumb. I'm just simplifying it so I don't have to write a five-page essay to make a simple joke. Yeah. <laughs> but boil down to American funny, haha. <laughs> Because I can make that joke. Because I have an American accent, so people will think I'm actually American. <laughs> Big brain. But yeah, don't eat Vegemite like it's a Nutella. It may look like Nutella, but it is not Nutella at all. I don't like Vegemite. You do not? I actually really love Vegemite. Um, I am seen as psychopathic, because I eat Vegemite like, like Americans and like videos do. Except they don't go, ew, gross, it's so strong, why would they make this, blah, blah, blah. I'm totally not eating it the wrong way, and that's why I'm, I don't like it. And it's totally the Australian's fault, and not the fact that I'm not eating it the right way. I, I just go, yummy. One time, because I'm not allowed to bring, because you're not allowed to bring, like, gloss in a school bag. Yeah. Especially since it could shatter everywhere. I bring the plastic Vegemite squeezy bottles to school, and I just squeeze the Vegemite out, out of the bottle into my mouth. And people just stare at me, even my teachers stare at me. And then one of my teachers, is just, like one of the teachers who knows me a lot, is just like, Yep, that's what they do. <laughs> they eat Vegemite like that. Uh, my friend doesn't like garlic bread. My friend bread. doesn't what like garlic bread, but what should I do? Uh, give Sacrifice them, them to the garlic bread gods. No. Give oh. them a 2000 <laughs> slide PowerPoint on why they should like garlic bread. Aren't there dumb people in old places? Americans are just more publicly dumb. True. Uh, no, Americans just have more access to the internet to say their dumbass things, and they aren't educated on why they should be dumb based off the stuff I- why they shouldn't be dumb based off the stuff I've seen. Yeah. And also, their laws are just wishy-washy and, like, so wrong. <laughs> That's a Pokemon. And so, they don't see the problem with it. <laughs> But yes, there are dumb people in all places. But Aww. coming from my experience in Australia, sure. you're less likely to find somebody screaming about how they want their basket robin rights bro broken back in Australia than you are in America. <laughs> like seriously, I go out a lot as long as like it's actually like safe in that. I have seen zero protesters. The closest oh, yeah. thing I got was going to my local shop and seeing people talking about like Jesus and the Bible and that and asking if we wanted to be ha handed a few scriptures from the Bible. That was the closest thing we got to people being dumb out in public and like like doing riots. That's the closest I've ever gotten to do that. It may just be that my like suburb isn't that busy, but I've been to the city. I didn't I didn't that I didn't need that like problem. Because I'm your certified, because I am the certified Australian of the group, I have yeah. to deal with things like what darkness sends me, where there's photo memes where it has a picture of a, like, most likely African savannah, because we do not have that wildlife and that, uh, like, that nature, and says, this is Australia, there are 1,335 different creatures in this picture that can kill you. But there are not. I feel like Americans are usually are usually like very extreme. Like Americans are either extremely dumb or extremely small or extremely loud or extremely quiet. The list can go on for a very long time. Yeah. I see. That. But it's more likely to it's more likely to go to the extremely dumb, extremely loud than it is quiet and smart. But there are a handful of people who are on the other spectrum, but the ones that get seen the most are the ones who are on the other side. So it can lead to a full sense of my majority, when in reality it's close to like 50-50, if not minority. Yeah. I don't know if any of what I said just made sense, and I do not know if I said it in a sarcastic tone, or a teacher-like tone, because I am autistic and I suck at regulating my tone, because why, brain? But whatever. I just 
one is closed. I forgot science since I was like 18. I think science is my worst subjects. My science worst is subject. one of my best subjects, even though I hate it. I absolutely hate science and history, and I'm so glad we're done with history. Seriously, we're done with history. We're moving over to geography. And while geography sucks, it's way better than history. Like, seriously, we cover the same thing over and over for two terms, an entire semester. It's just like, oh yeah, first fleet, uh, bring criminals down over here, uh, take on Australia. This one liver colony came Western Australia. Oh, we were called New South Wales because we, there, there's a country called Wales and we were the newer one and we were South. So we were New South Wales. And oh, Van, Van Diemen's Land was the old Tasmania. And they thought that it was connected to the mainland. And, and oh, like UK. It's like, bruh. Uh. For some dumb people, I, I get. For some, for sure, dumb people. I, I, I'm sorry, I'm having just have waiting is. For sure, dumb people get seen a lot, but I actually don't encounter many idi idiots in my day to day life. All the dumb people are just on Facebook. Yeah, but because of the fact that they're on the internet, they're more likely to be seen globally. Whereas, the entire like what seven billion people on Earth are all living in America and are able to that deduce whether or not like the internet dumb people that get seen the most because of anger being a very like strong emotion that it's the most likely to get somebody to share information online um to see whether or not that actually is the majority or not how how do i mix but that can make fire more powerful and add air that can also make fire powerful like don't like don't uh like don't like don't I I I'm sorry I'm having trouble reading that. You youngins don't know don't know what a dumb is posted on Facebook. Lol. My mom is on Facebook. I have to keep telling her. Don't believe everything you see on Facebook. <laughs> Please stop saying I saw it on Facebook. I'm dying of cringe. And she's just like, I don't care. I spoke. I'm sorry. It's a set. <laughs> all I hear in the background is <laughs> My sister is extremely loud. That's all I can say to that. <laughs> yep. I'm the youngest sibling, so. I'm the middle child. And I live with my brother. I live with my brother. I, my sister is the oldest. My sister is 23. Not like old, but oldest sibling. I'm really tired. It's 12, it's 12, 14 in the morning. I just want to go to sleep. But I don't want to leave stream. You, you stream for like three hours, so. so. I want to go back to the 1800s and experience. What's going on before COVID? Someone else the fuck. Aren't the 1800s when... I'm gonna sound really stupid because I don't pay attention in history. And we don't get taught this in history. But aren't the 1800s when the Black Plague happened? And like those doctors did like the mass happened? That look like they're cosplaying as birds. Yeah, I'm gonna go to sleep. Alright. Uh, I, I, don't, I don't have the energy to continue... Uh, staying awake. Fair enough. Good night. Good night. And there goes Chris. So now I'm alone. It's just me and you, chat. No one of these anymore. I'm gonna close that door because my brother stormed in and didn't close it. Blub blub. Agree. Ugh. Kind of called the National Animal of Wales is Dragon Scotland being caught in this call too. This call too. But a lot of the other national animals are mediocre. Like they're called, but they don't I know. 
I really like the fact that like those two countries have like mytholo mythological animals as their national animals. I like that. There was a question that I asked Chris earlier before you guys got here. What are your three favourite Pokemon? Because I said earlier as well that mine would probably be Inkay, Drifloon and Furfur at the moment. But mine change all the time, so like my opinions don't matter. So what are yours? Is it Indonesia the only nation that has a lot of Komodo I'm not entirely sure. Like I said before, I, I hate the <laughs> But it's an alpha one chat. Kinda wanna catch that. I'm not here. They're all listening to Zora and bonus Galantis. Nice. Yes. Thanks, Clank. I'll leave it. Catch up. Catch up. I'll record it. Fair enough. Let's go to I'm just gonna run around beating up helpless level 3 ish Pokemon. I start running around doing stuff now. I'm here for the starters. I don't even know if they can spawn these distortions here. But I need Cyndaquil and Oshawa. Because those are the two starters that I haven't finished Dex entries on already. And I've, and I've evolved all the ones that I've got. Which I know isn't great. What was that? Thank you for the follow. Um, where can they spawn here? Because I'm gonna feel really dumb if they can't. Okay, maybe I'm not, because of course gonna die. Okay. Of course might die, but you know. I'm surprised I didn't kill to be honest. Uh, let's go. Dark Dark is a bit of a Yeah. It kills. So why not? Oh, don't do that. That's scary. Okay, yeah. Goodbye. Uh, 
sure how long we're going to keep going for. Uh, where are you from? There's a pretty lot of drink for talking to, so I remember what you said. You said I'm from the UK. Really? I thought you were from Australia. I didn't find you very funny. I don't find myself funny. Then stop trying. Um, ignore that. My brother, yeah. But yes, I'm from the UK. What level? Oh, Abra. Oh, oh. Do we fully evolve Abra? Shiny Abra. I said, let's do it. I'll say the Abra shiny, the Abra line shiny is a quite disappointing. Quite disappointed, if I'm honest. Shiny Alexander has a nice teacher. Yeah, I prefer Shiny Alexander to the other two. So yeah, I do like Shiny Alexander. I, like, I really like the pink on him. I think it looks nice. Three completed, guys. I don't like how. Why can I only see the shiny form for Kadabra and not the other two? Why does it look so sick? See us. Um, goodbye. Have a good day. I hope you enjoyed the stream, and I will see you maybe next time. Maybe. We'll see. See ya. Try sleep some time. Yeah. It's always good to get sleep. I don't do it much. I should. I should do it more than I do. Let's go for Dark as well. I wonder how accents are formed, because you'd think a group of people with the same language would speak the same, but it's always vastly different. Yeah, I know. Accents always confuse me, because they're never... They're never what they're stereotyped to be. Like certain 
um, accent is like, oh that's a blank accent, but then it's just like completely different. Um, I don't really like a Syrian Lilibent. Then again, that might just be the um, pain it caused me while trying to cap it. Or trying to get it somebody else. But yeah, I don't really like it. Lilibent, Lilibent, Lilibent. can do an American accent. I can't do any accents. I'm not even going to try. I don't want to make myself look stupid. I do that a lot in public. I want to do on stream as well. Um, I have no moves that I need here. Yes, this is our. Well, this was is my first mod ever. Uh, let's go for. I want the dances, big three dance. You can't learn pedal dance. But yes, my. I fully evolved the Abra into a gorgeous Alakazam. Look at that. Oh, come out. Ow! I'm getting beaten up by balloon. Yes, there is all the commands. You need all the commands. Okay, flinch mark commands. That was a good new anime. <laughs> Probably sit and do some after spring. Or I can go and put myself through pain again, carry on with that um, Ultra Moon Nuzlocke that I've been doing in my own time for the past like, year. 127. Why are you victory dancing? Because I'm better than you, Mike. Back power now again. Imagine. How many times should I? I'm just going to do all 10. That's a decent amount. This should have a two stop being overkill. Nah. It sounds ridiculously tired and also kind of weird. It's. 7 a.m. for me, and no, I did not just wake up. That scared me. I, I have. I, I, have... I can't hear you. How are you? I am good. Oh. Yes. That, that it's is... weird to think of how my voice might sound to other people. Like, I probably have the strongest accent ever. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. Can you turn battle animations off? We do that, we make it go a lot quicker.
this is this is dog like cat from the Twitch chat. I just oh, yeah. got bored of typing. <laughs> there you go. It is a lot easier to just yep. speak. Very, very true. <laughs> Though in some cases it's not very easy to speak. I I mean I guess it really depends on who you are. Yeah. Fifty fifty four. What kind of food do you guys eat? Cause like I know there's differences in foods that people eat. Yeah. And I don't think that people from Britain necessarily like are obsessed with tea like culture. Oh, no. Cause that's 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 what Americans make fun of. I am that's, obsessed that's, with that's, tea. That's the, that's the American stereotypes. <laughs> every morning, every night, there's always a cup of tea. I just gotta say. Well, but yeah. <laughs> Naturally. Yeah. <laughs> oh, what about curry? Because there's curry in Pokemon Sword and Shield, and if I'm being honest, I've never had curry in my life. Is that like a normal thing that you guys eat? Um, I wouldn't necessarily it's a normal thing we eat, but we do eat it. Is it, it kind of like oatmeal? It's like, like you eat it sometimes, but it's not really a thing that you do very often? Yeah, I'd say that. It's, yeah. It's definitely always an option because not many people tend to choose it much. I feel like, especially in my family, there's, there's always a lot of pasta, which is quite weird. I think. Like, just Italian food in general. There is quite a lot of that, I'd say. Turns out I get much better audio quality from streams than I do from Discord. <laughs> well, it do be like that sometimes. <laughs> Why is it so Sadly. Yeah. Maybe I just have to switch to mobile data. Sometimes that's the issue, honestly. Yeah. What time is it for you? It's probably like noon or something. It's half past three. Half past three. So it is mid afternoon. Yeah. Yeah, I, I figured. <laughs> yeah. I didn't think it was half past like, I don't know, like three AM because there there is very clearly light coming from most likely outside in the webcam. The place I've never so... been. Wait, if British people don't, generally don't pass the tea while they drink tea, so I can I have a cup of tea? Fair. I mean... Don't people in Britain pronounce T that it's just a different pronunciation? Yeah. Definitely depends on where you're from from Britain, I'd say. There was like a whole video that I, I watched about how like there's just a different pronunciation of T and it still works as T and it's fine. Yeah. I want you to say water. Water. <laughs> uh, you would. <laughs> Why is there like no Pokemon all of a sudden? It's crazy. My my presence is warding off all of the Pokemon. They're gone now. Evidently. A bottle of water. I'm natural repel. A lot of words with T's in it are pronounced the T's and D's, so like bottle. What about bottle? Yeah, sometimes I pronounce it as D's instead of T's, but sometimes I just don't pronounce the T's. Hello. It depends on my mood, to be Get honest. A bowel wawa. Bowel wawa. <laughs> Oh. That's all I can hit to We had a part, this little party in the VC. 
Yeah. Much more sleep deprived for me than probably most other people. <laughs> I'm currently doing the thing where I'm just trying to stay up for like 24 hours so that I can actually fall asleep at the right time. Nice. It's a work in progress. <laughs> a while ago, not. I can remember I did try to do a 24 hour stream. I think we got to about 18 and a half hours. And then I went to sleep. Oh. My sleep schedule was messed up for oh, weeks that's after that. I like woke up at. I knew. Sorry, Carol. I I know that you guys like don't count your teeth, but when you said scream, it really like threw me off because I heard scream. <laughs> <laughs> Twenty-four hour scream. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I mean, I could try it. <laughs> it might be a thing I try. When, when's the sleep stream? It's not happening, Mike. Are you sure? Yes, I'm very sure. Come on. No. Okay, yeah. if no sleep stream, then say Bawa Wawa. Bawa Wawa. <laughs> cool. Yeah, my chat has like Mike. a weird obsession with a sleep stream. My golly gosh, when will Mr. Fish my sleep stream? I, I, there's too many sleep streams, I don't understand the point of it, like, no. it both, I feel like it feels weird on both ends, like, watching someone sleep, and, and sleeping and sleeping. having people watch you. Exactly. <laughs> like... Hello, monster. Oh, no. people... Why would I want people to watch me while I sleep, even if it exactly. gets me followers? Like, maybe I don't want the followers, I just like looking at people sleeping? Exactly. I don't know. Like, I want it's the followers, funny. but not the weirdos that watch people sleep. Look, some exactly! People, some people do, um, like, they record themselves sleep, but they also add things that would wake them up. This is all just to get, um, followers and stuff. Yeah. But how could you be that comfortable for someone to just watch you sleep? I know. What if you sleep for? Or <gasps> snort? That would be embarrassing, but you wouldn't know until you get like a, a clip or something, and it's just like, oh my gosh. Yeah. Imagine someone, like, they're, they're doing a sleep stream, but they like sleepwalk, and so for most of the sleep stream, they just walked off camera. I sleepwalk, never, so never. that would probably be me if I did a sleep stream. Do you actually? Yeah, like, I, I just wake up like on the kitchen floor and be like, oh wait, I was streaming me sleeping, and then just come back and just like, where is everyone? You've been gone for like 10 sleep. hours. Just... Sleep, 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 sleep. I have a way of doing like full 360s, but I never walk off. <laughs> like like sometimes I'll, I'll, I'll like go to sleep on one side of the, the bed and when I wake up I'll be like halfway off the other side of the bed. Like my head is like off the foot of the bed and I'm just like, how? How did I do this? I, I, I'm surprised myself. Yeah. Watch it. Do you know anything about PCs? Barely hey, anything. Fish. Yes, Michael. Proof or there? No. Come on. I don't trust you enough. Don't be a wimp. I am a wimp. Dog. If you don't accept the truth for there, I'll continue being British the whole rest of your life. It's worth it. <laughs> what? <laughs> the You're being rather dark today. I'm trying to think what next thing. I think it might be Xenoverse. Because I got that working again. Did you send me what you were doing on stream day? Did I? I did. Hmm. So I could check One, right here right now. Soon. 
How about this? If you do not accept my true color, I will make you get a copyright fight. Don't do that. Uh... Agreed. By singing that one Rick Roll song. Don't do that. <laughs> I mean... Will you get a copyright strike? Like, there's a chance, but I... You probably wouldn't as well. I but... probably wouldn't. Yeah. Plus, is it like three strikes and then you get kicked, or is there just like a uh, no tolerance for listening to music on Twitch? I'm not sure at all. Pokemon? I don't read what the terms I told conditions. You? I can't believe that one. I keep stealing my job. I'm very upset now. <laughs> I'm go I mean, if the truth or dare you are going to ask is something that he can trust you on, why can't you just ask it without the truth or dare? Good point. Plus, it wasn't even that bad, I only had a dare. What was it? Hey, Mr. Hey, Mr. Fish, could you please dab on no. stream? No. <laughs> Okay, Jemmy. Okay. Wait, 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 Jemmy, Jemmy. Hey, guess what? What? I love you, bro. Okay. Look at that. Just... Wait. Get the team out. Are you gonna tell me for something? My intruder. Huh? <laughs> The fitness ground pace of this is a multi stage of the capacities. Progressively gets more difficult as it continues. <sighs> I so wonder if it has an American accent in all countries or if they have a new person to voice act them in different areas. Now I'm gonna be Nothing. Now I'm gonna be thinking about that. <laughs> For a long time. I wonder if there's a ton of, like, universal candies, or if there's a ton of candy that, like, I know, and you guys don't have. Because, like, I feel like everybody knows Kit Kats, but sometimes <gasps> people say things that make me question things. Kit Kats, exactly. See? Why is, why is it called Kit Kats? Is it cats with something called Kits on it? Oh. Mm. Uh, we no, it's just all thick and it's chocolate, and there's little wafers on the bottom, and they're amazing. No, I, I get whole bags. But do you think they actually put a cat's in it, and that's the actual kind of thing inside? Mark, I don't want to no. think about that. <laughs> and the chocolate is a type of chocolate called Kit. So it's Kit Cat. My, I have a cat, don't make me think about this. <laughs> hey, uh, where do you live so I can have that cat for no, no reason in uh, just, just come to my house and make you a wanna know, cat. Like, you wanna know, like, a sin? So I have this friend who's from California, and I was talking to them about tea, because I like tea. And they told me... Because I, I, cause I, I mentioned tea bags, and they went, What's a tea bag? And I went, You know. <laughs> and, and I was trying to explain it to him. Apparently, the tea in his part of California comes pre made, and then they put it in the microwave, and I. I oh, that's and... just wrong. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Terrible. And apparently they don't have many flavors either. There's like three or something. Like like I have a whole tea cabinet in my house, so it's very confusing to hear this, you know? I don't get flavored tea. I just drink tea. What what do you what do you mean? Like the the tea has to come from something. That's the flavor. Just tea. <laughs> 
Is, is there tea flavored tea? I don't know, I'm dumb. <laughs> oh, it's very confusing. I. I oh, gotta go now. Okay. Ah, uh, goodbye. Remember to stay hydrated and drink bowel always. Goodbye, Mike. Do you prefer iced tea or like hot tea? I've only ever had proper iced tea once. And what? I, I didn't drink it because like it came with like all the leaves still in it and I just couldn't drink it because like, I kept like yeah. swallowing leaves and I hated it. Yeah. So my only that's, experience that's with real bad tea was pretty bad. Yeah, oh, oh, that that sucks. Um I don't know what to say. Uh, I like there's um so usually we make like like hot tea at home, but sometimes we like we brew the tea normally, but then we just put like way too much sugar and then we put it in like a, a cold cup and then a ton of ice, which is basically how I would make iced tea and it's so good, but it's gone in like five seconds and then I just feel sad. Oh. Which is why uh, hot tea is probably better because I have to like, I don't know, like limit myself otherwise I will burn my tongue. Yeah. Ice tea is not like that. <laughs> Maybe I'm just not patient. I will blame that on my ADHD. <laughs> I mean, I feel like I'm exactly the same, which I don't think I have ADHD. I might, but, you know, I haven't been... I haven't attempted to go to a doctor about it or anything. Like, get a psychiatrist or something? I don't yeah. know. ADHD is weird. Apparently there's this thing where like if you get a, a bigger group of people there's more likely to be more people with ADHD in it, which is weird. For example, if someone teaches a class with 10 kids, let's say like one kid has ADHD. If someone teaches a class with like 20 kids, then three kids will have ADHD, which makes no sense. That is but confusing. I, yeah. I think it's like ADHD is more common in bigger numbers because it's harder to focus or something. I have no clue. I understand that. <laughs> understand not having a clue or understand the reasoning? Both. <sighs> Fair enough. Have you ever been to, like, a, a petting zoo? Because... Like, I don't go very often, but I went to a petting zoo that I went to when I was younger, like, recently, and it was amazing. Because not only were there, like, regular petting zoo animals, like goats and whatever, I got to, like, hold a fox, and I got to pet, like, a serval, and uh, an African fisher cat, and I got to pet a baby panther and a baby bear. It was a very fun experience. I would love to have that experience. But yeah. I've never been to like an... When I was younger, I also got to pet a, a baby jaguar, and I tell stories of that in uh, my Two Truths and a Lie, like every school year. Nice. Yeah, I've never been to like a proper petting zoo, but I can remember um, one, one year on my cousin's birthday, like they invited me to the party, and I was just like, uh, yeah, sure, I'll come. Don't really like you that much, but yeah, I'll come. And then um, they had this like these people around, and they had all these different animals. So I got to hold a like animals like a tenret. I think there was there was Aww. there was a massive snake there. I love snakes; they're my favourite animal. So I got to hold about I think it was um, ten feet long, something like that, and I got to hold it. So that was a great experience for me. And. Then there was a smaller one, and I can't remember any of the others. But those were, that was like my favourite experience with animals. 
You know something that I like I do as like a kind of job that's really rewarding is cat sitting because I can actually have a cat. My family is allergic. Um and like I cat sit for some friends and it's amazing and I bond with the cats. I feel like the cats know me very well. Uh, it's, it's very nice. I feel like I feel like most people who don't like cats have never really like actually hung out with a cat for like a long yeah. period of time. Like for some people, a cat could like be not for them, but they are adorable. Yeah, I have a apparently cat. They also carry like a... Apparently, cats carry this type of uh, parasite, um, and the uh, the parasite. I, I forgot what I was going to say. Give me like three seconds. Yeah, so it's, it's a parasite that actually makes people like cats or something like that. Uh, and like two in three humans just have this parasite apparently. And it was originally made because um, it would make mice more likely to... Um, you know, be around cats because they wouldn't see cats as a threat, um, which would then make the cat live longer, which would help the parasite, like, reproduce, and so it helps both the cat when eating, and it helps the parasite, and so apparently they're all over the place, so that's kind of weird. A, a little kind of super weird, but you know... <laughs> Not something you want to think about, but no. strange fact I know. Yeah, so yeah, I have a cat, and um, you're lucky that cats actually like like you, because I think my cat's coming up to being about eight now. So yeah, I've had her a long time, and she just don't like me that much. Um, Any time no. I try to like have any sort of interaction with her, she either just completely ignores me and walks away, or tries to attack me. So you're just lucky that cats like you. <laughs> is all I can well, say. Well, what what are you doing, perhaps, with the cat? Nothing much. I just sort of like sit like near her, like maybe stroke her sometimes, and then she just like attacked me. But really? then, if my, is... if my brother does the exact same thing, she like starts being like a lot more loving, stuff like rubbing up against him and all that. Which I don't understand. Things with cats are usually like on their own terms. You can't really force anything on a cat. You can't be like, "We're petting now" or whatever. And I don't yeah. think that's what you're you're doing. But they can be really tricky when you first meet them. I find it best to like just be around them a little bit, get them some food, keep your distance. You gotta let them approach you and not you approach them. I like to, yeah, just being in the same room definitely helps because it's a really key part when the cat wants to hang out with you and it's not you want to hang out with the cat. Yeah. I get that. So I sort of like to do that. Like if like she doesn't want any interaction with me, I just sort of like sit like across the room from her. And just sort of like- You're not staring at her, right? No, I just like- Sometimes I forget she's there, to be honest. <laughs> I just, like, find something else to do. Like, maybe just, like, sit there, like, attempting, like, another lock on a random Pokemon game that, like, I found somewhere. And then sometimes it just, like, comes up to me, looks at me, and then walks away. Mysterious. You know, exactly. it's kind of weird how cat meow. I don't know if you're cat meows, but apparently they, um... They only do that for people. Like they never meow yeah. at like other cats. It's not like a thing they do. They meow to like try and communicate with us, which yeah. is weird. And they actually have ways of like seeing what meows are the cutest and which ones get them the most treat, whatever, and like a positive response, which is hilarious that they do that. Fun yeah. fact. Um. Dogs kind of have like a thermal vision. It's not really a vision, but they can see things like in thermal because of this like little thing in their nose, which is how um, 
baby puppies can move around and like find things because they're blind and they, you know, they don't have most of their senses. I think they are blind and they can't smell is the thing. Oh. So they kind of just like waddle around and they would be doing that blind, but they have like a thermal sense so they can like see where their mom is and crawl over there. It's really neat. Nice. So yeah. that's how if you drop like some hot food, the color dog will like instantly know where the food is because the thermal thing. Nice. Yeah. I know some random dumb facts sometimes, it's just kind of like taking a gamble. What facts will show up next? Who knows? Yeah. Kind of feels like the, um, the text generation when you're like um, playing Doki Doki, but if you just like sit there with Monica, how, like after a while she'll just like randomly show up with a sentence about some random topic, which yeah. is... <laughs> A horrible example, but it's also a really great example to how it feels for me sometimes. I'm like randomly coming up with some fact that I know from Oblivion that has nothing to do with anything that has been previously discussed. I definitely do that. Like, if like I'm around someone, especially like someone that I have a crush on or anything, if like it goes quiet, I just like s s try to start a conversation with just like something that I found out a few years ago. And then <laughs> exactly. It, 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 it just sprouts into like a whole like 10, 10 minute conversation about it. Yeah, but then after the conversation is over, there's just like a kind of awkward silence until you can find the next thing to talk yeah. about. I mean, I can't relate to the whole having crushes thing, but you know, it, it's it's all good. <laughs> Yeah, so there's always definitely like a period of time in between each like mini conversation and the main conversation of like trying to think of things to actually like talk about. Exactly. It's always I have a habit well. of like when it's on like a voice call that I'll just like look around my room for like hints and clues of something that I could <laughs> talk about. What is your favorite shiny? Sorry. What is your favorite shiny? Like, you have a favorite Pokemon, but what's your favorite shiny? Hmm. You ever think about that one? I never think about that one. <laughs> Most people don't. It gives people enough time to think. I mean, I don't have... A, I'll be honest, I don't have, like, a particular favorite, but I do have many many favorites, like just ones that I like in general, yeah. and uh, I also, it's funny because a lot of them are just my original favorite Pokemon, like, um, Zorua's shiny makes it look like, um, uh, mint chocolate chip ice cream. Yeah. I love it. <laughs> and, um, the Lorantis shiny just looks beautiful, I, I actually Lurantis don't think shiny. it can go wrong. Well. I know, right? Yeah. I I made a whole team on Showdown of just Mantis Pokemon because I was bored, and I ended up sleeping my friend with it, and it was super exciting because I didn't think it would be able to actually work because every single Pokemon is weak to fire. Yeah. <laughs> think of one Pokemon that's a Mantis that isn't weak to fire. I can only think of one Pokemon that is a Mantis. <laughs> What's that? Lorantis. But that's the thing. Yeah. Lorantis isn't even a Mantis. I put Lorantis in there, but Lorantis is actually based off of the um, Orchid Mantis, um, which is a, a Mantis that mimics a flower. But in Pokemon, they swapped the concept Lorantis is actually a flower that mimics a mantis or a bug, and I love it so much. I love that concept. Me too. It's the concept that brings me the most joy. Like, I love yeah. the design, but the concept for Lorantis is the reason why I love the Pokemon so yeah. much. Oh, 
<laughs> I didn't notice that my iPad turned off. The the one that I had the screen going on. Oh. I'm still trying to think about what my favorite shiny is. Like it's favorite actually shiny. quite well, difficult. It is. It's more difficult because, like, you know, every day you see the regular Pokemon, but yeah. it's kind of hard to remember a lot of shinies unless they particularly stick out to you. Like how shiny Fampy is horrible and disgusting, or how shiny Espeon looks like an alien. Yeah. I'd say the first one that comes I, I mean, to mind like you. when I think of a shiny that I like is Shiny Sylveon. Well, but, yeah, everybody thinks of that. Yeah, but I know that there is definitely one Either that I like more. Sorry? It's just like what people think of first. When you think of Pokemon, I mean, some people think of Pikachu, but usually people, like, their first thought is Eeveelutions for whatever yeah. reason. I think, I feel like the Eevee line is like the new mascot for Pokemon, whether yeah. they want to admit it or not. Like, people just like the Eevee line more. Yeah. But my favorite, my, my sister's favorite Pokemon is Eevee. I feel like oh, it's because it's the first yeah. one she was, like, exposed to. Yeah, that, that happens all right. Yeah. Like... Eevee isn't a bad Pokemon, but when someone's favorite Pokemon is like an Eevee Lucian or like Pikachu, it kinda is like, you don't play Pokemon, do you? Yeah. <laughs> uh, and I mean, there's some cases where people just like really like Sylveon or something and they like, uh, and they're like super fans of it, but most of the time, Almost a hundred percent of the time, if someone's favorite Pokemon is Eevee or Pikachu, they they don't really play the games like yeah, at all. They I... have played like three Pokemon games maximum. Yeah. Alpha Beedoof. What is, is so going big. on in chat? I have no idea. Look how big the Alpha Beedoof is. Oh, hold on. I I gotta see real quick. Whoa. That, yeah, yeah, that's a chonky boy. <laughs> I, I still have, like an alpha Bidoof uh, compared to like some regular Bidoof. I actually have still not been able to, like after all of the time that the game's been out, get like a weasel that is the right size for this dude. I have the most ginormous weasel in the universe but no matter how many Buizel I catch, it's never enough. The thing is though, is the first Buizel I caught was the one that I gave for that quest. And I don't understand like Seriously? how everybody's having so much trouble with it, because it was the first Buizel I caught, and it was the it, right one for the quest. No, it was, like, it was one of the first Pokemon I caught in the entire game, and I just gave it for that quest. You're, you're kidding. I'm not. And it just confuses me I that so many people are having issues with it. In short, it's embarrassing. <laughs> Pain. Pain and also suffering. Why does this guy need a weasel that's that huge? You can very much so tell that this weasel is bigger than your weasel. Like, I threw my weasel down to compare and took a screenshot because they were, like, crazy size difference and he's like I, I need a big one and I'm like what do you mean this is a big one <laughs> yeah I just realized you don't even get it much <laughs> cuz you know you didn't have the issue but I had the issue and apparently a lot of other people did but you know hmm. What is your favorite of the Hisuian starters? Like, the Hisuian starter changes? I would say it was Decidueye. Because I saw the starters before I played the game. And Decidueye was just like, was the one that stuck out to me. So it was just like, I'd pick it. Yeah. I like the, the Decidueye the most. Especially because Typhlosion 
I've never been a fan of Typhlosion. Many, like, people are going to hate on me for that. But, like, it only looks good when the fire is out. And, like, it's kind of okay then, but it still kind of feels kind of bland. Like, I feel like Typhlosion could just be a, a middle stage evolution. Yeah. It doesn't feel like the, the final form. And then here, they, like, they updated it, but they didn't really do much. They just kind of, like, yeah. made him emo and gave him more wispier fire. Yeah, I feel like Dissiki was is the only one that they actually, like, changed apart from just, like, the colours. Oh, which is a shame, because the Samurai, like, it was a good idea. I feel like they just needed to expand on it more. Yeah. Because, like, I actually like regular Samurai. The reason I didn't pick it was that it just wasn't different enough for yeah. me. You know? Like, when I want a Hisuian form, I don't want this Pokemon... It's kind of curly. It's slightly different. Like I wanna, I want it to be different. Yeah. And that is also the reason what why is I didn't. What favorite Pokemon? Oh, um, favorite Assyrian Pokemon. There's so many good ones. I'm struggling to think of them all off the top of my head. I'm just, uh, I'm just gonna search up a list. Um, no, no, I got it, I got it. I can name all of them in a jiffy. I bet you don't, I don't know, you might. Um, Hisuian Growlithe, Hisuian Arcanine, Hisuian Voltorb, Hisuian Electrode, Hisuian Typhlosion, Hisuian Quillfish, Hisuian Sneasel, Hisuian Samurai, Hisuian Lilligan, Hisuian Zorua, Hisuian Zoroark, Hisuian Bravery, Hisuian Sligu, Hisuian Gudra, Hisuian Avalok, and Hisuian Decidueye. I would say that my favourite Assyrian form would probably be Zoroa and Zoroark, because even though like, I don't really understand the change, I do like I like the type, I guess. The, the normal and ghost type is amazing, and also Thuyan Zoroa is so cute. I am very torn yeah. between whether I like regular Zoroa or Hisuian Zoroa more. Oh. I do feel like I prefer regular Zor Zoroark's design mm. because, I don't know, the Hisuian Zoroark little red dots didn't really... I don't know, I didn't really like it. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest here, I've never really been a fan of Zoroa and Zoroark until the Hisuian forms were... Um, like, until I saw the Hisuian really? forms. Yeah. I like, I like the gimmick well, and everything, I just I feel like the designs were a bit lacking. Fair enough. I, I just really like how cute Zoroa is, and Zoroark kind of just comes along with it. Also, I've played with a Zoroa in my team for a long time, and by a long time, I mean many X and Y runs and many black and white runs. I don't know, I, I feel like it kind of grows on you over time, if you, yeah. like, play with it. I feel like any design kind of does. Like, originally, I wasn't a fan of Bisharp, but then, like, one carried a Black 2 run, and I was just like, oh my gosh, I I suddenly love it, you know? Yeah, I was exactly the same with Furfru. Like, Furfru is now one of my favorite Pokemon, but it's only because, like, I'm doing an Ultra oh, Moon oh, 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 oh. Furfru has an amazing shiny. I haven't seen Furfru shiny. I've never seen it. You haven't seen Furfru shiny? No. So you know how Furfrau has like a, a black face and then like oh. white fur and how it can like change its uh like hairstyles and yeah. stuff? Yeah. So the face color and the fur color swap. <gasps> and you get this like bluish black fur and a, like a white face, and it's amazing. Oh. I really like it, and I got really upset. Well, not really upset, but I was just like freaking out because a streamer that I was watching, like, got one. It was I their love first that. time ever getting a shiny, and it was their first time like playing a Pokemon game in years, and they, they kind of just like got it, and they caught it, and like, oh, this must be shiny. That's cool. And they put it in the box, and they forgot about it forever. No. I know! It was their first shiny, and they put it in a box, and they forgot about it forever, and I'm like, you know what? I died a little bit. 
Not only was it their first shiny, but it was like a good shiny and a fairly good Pokemon. Because like it, around the beginning of their their game too, right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, I don't know. It feels like such a long. Hmm. is one of my favorite Pokemon now because I'm doing an Ultra Moon Nuzlocke in like my own time because I've never really done a proper Nuzlocke, and I got um, I think it was literally my last run, run six. Um, where I got a fur through in Howley City and it carried me until I accidentally lost it to a trainer with a Sylveon just before Lush Jungle. I, I literally yeah. cried when I lost it. Yeah, fur through was really good, especially early game. Yeah. Like, it's really bulky, especially Sorry if you get. If, I um, fur, if you get the fur coat ability, it's like one of the bulkiest Pokemon you can get early game. Because it's just normally, it's normally specially bulky, and then if you get fur coat, that um, that boosts its physical bulk as well, which just helps you really a lot. Honestly, true. Yeah. Um, I'm sorry if I ramble sometimes when I get like interested in a topic and I have stuff to say about it. I am really bad at knowing when to stop talking. I'll just keep going. Sometimes yeah. I like have to pause and be like, wait, they might have something to say, <laughs> huh? Like, like, cause like I'll hear like like any bitty thing if you like wanting to like start talking about something, and I'll just keep going <laughs> because I don't know, I can never stop. I swear. I'm exactly. You know, the once same. once I get offended, I can't stop. Kind of like an Igglybuff, because believe it or not, there's a Pokedex entry that says. Um, that once oh, yeah. Igglybuff starts bouncing, it cannot stop, which yeah. is depressing <laughs> a little bit. Like, it just keeps going. I, I just, like, imagine this, like, pinging back and forth between a ton of <laughs> things. Yeah. You're like, <laughs> it's, like, shoot fast. Yeah, I'm exactly the same with talking. Like, sometimes I struggle to get started, but then when I do, I just don't stop until I'm actually done with what I'm saying. I know, right? Um, have you ever taken the Myers-Briggs type indicator? It's like a, uh, personality test. Also, I think I just said indicator. <laughs> uh, indicator. <laughs> it's a personality test where people, they divide, like, types of people into, um, 16 personalities. And usually I'm not, like, a big fan of... Uh, the whole like personality test things because I think they're phony and pseudoscience yeah. and whatever. But then I took it and it was like scarily relatable. And this is coming from someone who thinks that zodiac signs are the most baloney thing to ever exist. Mm. So I'm not that gullible, I don't think. <laughs> yeah. You can have to send me a link to the test and I'll just do it after stream. If you want to send me a link oh, through sure. Discord DM and I'll go for it. Mm. Like if you want to, I'll yeah, stay sure. on VC after stream and carry on. And I'll do Honestly, it. sometimes I, I like just seeing people take the test on stream because it's very interesting. And I am so dumb, I copied the link on my iPad and then clicked on my phone to send it to you. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, do I put in the general? Um, if you wanted to send it through DM. Alright, alright, hold on. I just realised how much of a mess the Discord server is. Like, there's so many, um, <laughs> channels that aren't needed. <laughs> yeah. There you go. I might do it after stream. Or if you're lucky, I'll do it on stream. I was just going to send it. I sent, I sent the link because I will forget otherwise. Yeah. I have very little attention span. I feel like my memory is that of a Rhyhorn. Um, you, you might be wondering what the hell am I talking about? <laughs> uh, I will explain. So there is a Pokedex entry. I know, more Pokedex entries. <laughs> Amazing! Um, <laughs> there is a Pokedex entry that states 
um, that a Rhyhorn, when it starts charging, it will not stop charging until it hits something, and then it goes to sleep, and that oftentimes it forgets why it was running, <laughs> and just keeps going. <laughs> I love that deck entry. <laughs> Me too. And there are a lot of little dex entries that I love. My personal favorite dex entry is um, Drampa's dex entry from, I think, Ultra Sun that says um, that if a child it likes um, is getting bullied, it will find the bully's house and then burn it oh, to the yeah. ground. Oh, yeah. I love that so much. Oh, Drampa for the win. Drampa is yes. my spirit Pokemon. Exactly. Like if someone hurts, like someone I like am friends with or is my family, then I will like hurt them. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not that aggressive, but the same thing. I like to hurt people with words so that I don't go to jail. Yay. Yeah. <laughs> Woo. <laughs> So blind. I went past that three times. I need hydro pump. Hydro Sometimes pump I wish you could hear the response in my brain if I try and find a new um, conversation topic. <laughs> hey, there's like a little loading bar. Like I can see it, <laughs> but you can't. There's like a restarting. <laughs> um. Sometimes I wish that there's, like, a little printer for your memories and your dreams. Like, I could have, like, little drawings of my dreams when I wake up so that I can, like, see the whole storyboard because my dreams are, like, full-on movies sometimes. Like, I have the most bizarre dreams. I could spend, like, hours talking about dreams I have because I remember them, but I often have, like, multiple dreams, but I remember all of them, and, I, and my dreams just kind of, like, slur together in one strange mix so yeah. like for example there is a dream where i am the detective of a murder mystery but also <laughs> in a previous dream i had helped an old man uh how like learn how to use um like get games on his phone <laughs> i i helped an old man learn how to get games on his phone and add like a little keychain and they kind of mixed together, and so the murderer ended up being the old man with the flip phone and the keychain. <laughs> <laughs> Which made no sense, because um, it was previously established in the dream that the guy, like the murderer, hadn't been outside of like the murder area in like 30 years. So, um, my dreams aren't very consistent. I've actually, like, changed speech multiple times in dreams, it just kind of happened. <laughs> At one point I was in Axolotl with like family issues in a different dream by the way, and then when I went to school I was suddenly me again, and I just continued, and eventually I went outside on the field, and I had creative mode, and I flew up into the sky, <laughs> and I found a ton of people there, and there was Ultra Necrozma. <laughs> Well, that's just fantastic. <laughs> oh. My dreams are so bizarre. <laughs> My Alpha Eevee can evolve, and I think it's going to become a Sylveon. Oh, that's cool. I'm going to uh, go for or it. Or it's going to be like an Espeon. I hope not. Because um, it's possible. I love it's Sylveon. It's either a Sylveon or an Espeon. Jeez, Sylveon. That's a Sylveon! Oh, I just realized the music is completely different in, um, on, like, Legend Arceus. I was doing the old one. I mean, it's similar, but I, I, I have to get a different thing. What's about Alpha like, Sylveon? drums and stuff. I Do you know how to play that. any instruments? I can press keys on a piano. <laughs> 
I can also press keys on piano, and sometimes I press the keys in an order, and then I repeat that order multiple times because I don't know what else to do. Same. <laughs> Amazing. And I have like, um, like a, a very musical friend that actually knows this kind of stuff, and I'll just like send these like dumb videos of me just like pressing keys on the piano that I think work, and then he'll like send me like a full on remixed version of the song where he like added a ton of instruments and it's all insane. I'm like, whoa. <laughs> oh, I just realized that there's a message a while ago. Fun fact, Grandpa was actually gonna have a counterpart called Grandma. That is, that would have been cool. Like Grandpa and Grandma. I would have loved that. Grandpa and Grandma. Well, I'm just going to Grandma's wait, house. Wait, Grandpa. <laughs> <laughs> when the realization hits. <laughs> For some reason, my chat isn't actually like updating. Oh. It's 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 just dead. Like the, like the stream's still going fine, and you can see the little like chats in the side of the, the stream. But the actual chat box is frozen at chat revive, which is the most humorous place for the <laughs> chat to freeze. It's perfect. Which means time to refresh. I, 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 I hate being sick because I have to breathe more, which is usually fine, but I like to talk like I'm some kind of auctioneer and I'll just keep going without taking breaths. <laughs> and now I have to like take a breath every 5 to 15 seconds and it really throws off the whole rhythm of my sentences. I hate being sick because I have to breathe. <laughs> I mean, yeah, kind of. <laughs> but you can hear like when, when I'm when I'm talking or when I was laughing just there. I don't know if you can hear. Maybe Discord like cuts it all out. But it just I I have to like gasp back for air. <laughs> Throws off the whole mood, honestly. Yeah. <laughs> the breathing ever get in your way when talking? Try not breathing. Exactly. Don't do that. <laughs> it could be fatal. If breathing gets in the way, just stop. PC's hot. What are you doing with it? Well, not hot, but warm. People? People. Siblings. Ah, oh, weird. I don't have any of those. I'm the middle child. I am the uh, one and only I am the child. child. You are the child. <laughs> I am the child. Which means... I get all of the love and affection and also all of the expectations, which I I very quickly was like, hey, I'm not going to meet any of these. Um, I, I got straight A's for like a few years, and then I got so stressed that like I just stopped working for two. And and, and now they don't have any, any expectations for me, and they can be happy when I get B's and C's and the occasional A in categories that I do well in. This is, this is what you call how, how you life. <laughs> <laughs> you, you just stop working. You don't like communicate your problems normally. It's just like, oh, I'm stressed. Guess I will listen to music for the entirety of class. <laughs> I have issues. Not that many issues, but some. <laughs> um... For example, like, I, the cops have been called on me. What? <laughs> I, I'm not a criminal. Fear not. It's just, um, apparently this is kind of common with people with ADHD. I didn't know this. But, um, 
when I feel too stressed in a situation, I will have the urge to run away. And when I was younger, I was not very good at controlling that. So one time in the middle of school, I got so upset that I just picked up my bag and walked out the school gate. Just gone. Oh. <laughs> and that's the story of when I got the cops called on me. Love and that. now my parents are getting mad at me for yelling at like 8 a.m. Ah, uh, frick. <laughs> You're not the only person who sleeps at the wrong time. This is this is a, it's a genetic problem. <laughs> it's not my fault. I'm good at holding a conversation. What do you want, mother? <laughs> yes, this whole rule about not calling. Uh, until a certain hour and not calling after a certain hour because I don't even know. Like, I can barely tell when is good hours and when is not. It just depends on her sleep schedule. You have to be like, is she sleeping? No? Okay, I'm able to talk. <laughs> Life. Yeah. I know, right? Oh, yeah, the other day, um, I woke up, and I had missed something that I needed to, because I woke up two hours late, and I had got on a Twitch stream, because I didn't know what to do at that point, point. I was having fun for a while, and then, like, a few minutes in, I felt something on my arm, and when I turned, there was just a spider there, oh. and then, that was fun. <sighs> So that happened. Uh, there's like two types of people in the world. There's the people that love spiders and the people that hate spiders. What are you? I hate them. Yeah, I mean... Okay, I just said that there's two types of people, but I'm kind of the middle ground. I mean, sometimes they're cute, but that's more like Lucas the spider. Um, oh, I love Lucas. I, I usually find spiders cute when they are like being tyrants to other people I know because I'm weird um they're like oh my gosh I'm a spider I'm like oh but like when it's actually a spider in my real life I'm like why the hell are you in my room like I'm, I'm not like actually like scared or anything like most people I just want to give them an eviction notice um so there's like this little sometimes not often but there there will be spiders and we have like this spider killer that's what my mom calls it it's actually um a lint roller for dog hair on a really long stick um and we just kind of get it and we just roll it on the wall to kill spiders but it's kind of hard to do that when it's in your bedding, so I had to find, like, the first thing nearby to kill the spider as I was, like, chasing it around, trying yeah. to not get lost in my bedding, because you don't want a spider lost in your bedding. Mm. Don't know if you know this, but it's not something that you usually want. If that happened to me, I just wouldn't sleep. <laughs> I, I feel that, but also I'm a very strange individual like the kind of person that finds more comfort sleeping under the bed than on top of it huh. but I'm not allowed to do that anymore <laughs> huh. I I'm the monster <laughs> there's like I, I always found it funny that there's like a whole metaphor about coming out of the closet because I when I was little I used to like take the stuffed animals out of my my like my toy bin it wasn't a box it was like a ginormous bucket and I would take the toys out I took all the stuffed animals out and I would curl up in the middle and I'd put all the toys on top and my my parents would spend hours looking for me and I would just be sleeping and that's how I would get out of school <laughs> no I have I, I am able to sleep anywhere. I've slept underneath a slide, I've slept um, like in a hotel lobby, 
Not in the actual hotel, just in the lobby, um, the Taco Bell, the car. <laughs> Haven't slept in, on an airplane yet, which is weird. I I'm under the bed, on top of the bed, um, on the floor, um, in the kitchen. Oh, there was a, one time when I like migrated from the living room to the kitchen. That happened. That was like a long time ago. Um, I've. Oh, well, now I'm blanking on places I've slept, because I sleep everywhere. Um, I've slept in the toy bin, I've slept in boxes, like a cat. That was a thing that happened. <laughs> um, yes. The point is, yeah. Please. Yeah. It's, it's a very good thing. Um, I find that for me, sleep is kind of like an all-or-nothing thing. Like, I will either sleep for hours on end and have the most amazing sleep anyone has ever seen or get like four hours of sleep and then wake up and then be like time to start a 20 hour day and do that very very two different sides I, I have to pick one sometimes but recently I'm doing the getting too much sleep kind of thing uh I, I sleep for like 15 hours and go, oh crap, I need to wake up. Like usually I would sleep, here's the thing, right? I'll, I'll go to bed early so that I wake up early, yeah. but I don't end up waking up early. Like no matter when I go to bed, I still exactly. end up waking up at 5 p.m. and there's nothing that I can do about it. <laughs> yeah, a lot of my parents do the exact same thing. They're just like, right, go to bed early so you can wake up early. I just don't. I, I don't know what it is, but you want to know the funny thing, right? I am, like, lazy to the point where I prepare my alarms for being lazy, so I'll set one alarm for, like, an hour before I need to wake up, and then I'll set another half an hour before I need to wake up, and I'll put the snoozes on, but I leave the snoozes on five minutes. Um, uh, oh, yeah, yeah, uh, ab about this whole snooze thing, so I have like a five minute snooze, right? Um, the other day I was really tired and I ended up pressing snooze um, 48 times before I accidentally turned the alarm off. I was supposed to press snooze again, but that works too. <laughs> I just realized it is half past four now. Is it? It's been an wow, hour since realize. you joined VC. Okay. Huh? It's been an hour since you joined in the VC. I, I didn't even notice. I was too busy talking. Yeah. Time has gone so fast. <laughs> what can I say? I talk a lot. <laughs> <laughs> um, There's this game that I like to play that, like, nobody has heard of in the history of ever called Cattails. It's like, um, and it's an indie RPG where you play as a cat and that's, that's, that's just about it. And you do, you, you do things. It's very fun. You interact with other cats. Um, you battle other colonies sometimes. That, yeah, that happens apparently. Um, you forage for, like, plants and you hunt food and apparently there's a cat economy and cat government, but you don't talk about that because it's not the selling point of the game. Um, <laughs> brain is, you know, rebooting. Hold on. Hold, just give me a... I'm gonna look at the game. What's that? What's that flavor of gum? Huh? Hello? Hello? What is the best flavor of gum? Do you, do you, ha do you have gum there? I feel like you have gum there. Yeah. People have gum, right? Yeah. Yeah, people have gum. What, what flavor of gum do you Ooh. like? Because... <laughs> I feel like a lot of people like regular mint, but I feel like regular mint kind of has a bad taste, so if you want a mint, you go for spearmint, because it's more sweet, and it, I don't know, it tastes better, but then some people really don't like spearmint, and uh, something that people really don't like is fruity flavors, but I find that watermelon on gum oh. works very well. Um, 
But what, when it comes to watermelon gum, you can never actually blow bubbles with it. So you'd think maybe bubble gum, but bubble gum's too generic and sugary. You know, it's a very complex question, yeah. and I'm not just asking because I found a gum wrapper. Um, I have no idea because um, there's a lot of them, and um, I can remember once my friend found this like tropical flavored one. And it, it was it was it was like it was one that could blow really good bubbles. So I tried it, and I love it. That is my definite flavor. I don't know what brand it was, but it like it came in like little cubes. And what it, that sounds like? It's like Trident. But then again, I just realized you're from an entirely different country, and it might have just been. A gum brand that I've never heard of in my life, but it sounds like Trident to me. It might have been actually. That sounds like. Let me see if I can. Um. Ooh. Yeah, I think it was. Um, yeah. Yeah. Thoughts so on the Pokemon card game? I know a lot of people at my school, and uh, I'll be like, oh, do you like Pokemon? And I'm like, yeah, I like Pokemon. I'm like, oh, cool, what's your favorite game? And they'll be like, oh, I don't play the games, I just like the cards. And I, I, I don't know, I, I really don't like it when people say that. I don't know if you get that, but it just feels like, oh. Yeah. You just like the cards? Yeah. Like, I don't want to say that. They aren't really a Pokemon fan if all they do is have cards, but at I get the same that. time, it's just like, Ugh. I've never really played the card game, necessarily. I'm trying to get most into it, don't. because okay. I have a most massive box of them. The card game. They just get the cards, and then they're like, hey, look, I own this card. And yeah. then they trade them around or something. Yeah. I don't know. I have like a massive box of the cards and I'm trying I've been thinking about like getting into it because like I've been having a look at what um you can get the card game online on but you can't really get it on any devices that I play on apart from my PC. So I might just like get it on my PC and start getting into it because I've wanted to get into it but it's difficult to get into it if you understand what I mean. Mm hmm I um oh there there is a story this is the person in my life that I dislike the most because I'm gonna be honest, I don't have many situations in my life where I dislike people. But back in fourth grade there was a girl, um, and um I was like I brought my Pokemon cards to school to show them off. And this girl was like my second or third best friend at the time which I heavily regret and I brought the cards to school I showed them to her and she was like oh wow those are really cool Pokemon cards could I borrow them and I'm like no and no you no they're, they're my cards and she goes um and she says oh what you don't trust me and I'm like not really. And she's like, what? I thought we were friends. And I'm like, mm. And she's like, come on, please. And I'm like, fine. And I let her borrow the card for whatever reason. And, like, she says that she'll bring them back. I don't know why I believed her, but, uh, you want to know why I'm telling you this story? Because, because she, she never brought them back. And I asked her about them, and she just went, oh, I lost them. And apparently those cards were worth a lot. So, you know what? I don't think you lost them. <laughs> and that is what ended an old friendship of mine in when I when I was in like 4th grade. <laughs> oh wow. To this day, the person that I dislike the most really goes to show how few people I actually dislike. Yeah. I mean, maybe the second would be this other girl that just has a really bad attitude. But that's about it. <laughs> I can remember. I don't really dislike. That's not my thing. <laughs> I can remember in my primary school, 
um, a lot of people's like starting to bring like their cards into school, and a lot of people are like, actually like like saying like, "Oh, do you want to trade?" and then just like took all their cards somehow, and that got them banned from my primary school. Yet people still did it, so eventually they ended up just like taking any cards that they found on the students who just took them away. And just didn't give them back ever. So people actually like stopped taking them in. So it's efficient, but it was cruel. I met this one kid who was really annoying, and he was like obsessed with Pokemon cards. And he, uh, I like I I, t I talked to him like a few times, and one time he was like, "Yeah, it's gonna be my birthday tomorrow." And it happened to be like on the same day as my mom's birthday. I'm like, whoa, that's cool. Should I get you a birthday present? He's like, yeah, that'd be cool. But then I kid you not, the next month he goes, oh, what? Next, and my birthday is gonna be next week. And, and he did this once a month. Once a month. And that's why I never gave him the birthday present. <laughs> oh. That kid. Yeah, yeah, I, I'm pretty sure he was just trying to get gifts or something. I don't know. He was full of stuff like that. He liked to give phony things away in trade for not phony things. and I Didn't really like him that much. But, you know, I don't avidly dislike him like I do with the girl from the previous story. So it's all good. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so I think I'm gonna end stream there. Because uh, I'm gonna go in. Little chatter, you have to like have lunch or something. Uh huh. So, yeah. Have we got anyone that we're gonna raid? Ooh, raid. Raid. Realize, won't you be able to get like affiliate uh, and like six more followers? Yeah. And That's then neat. I just need, I think, seven streams in a month, which I should get on Tuesday, because I started streaming both Tuesdays and Saturdays, so we could get there, hopefully. Alright, so, no one I'm following on this account is live, so... Um, has anyone got anyone that they want me to raid? I'd have to look. Yeah, there's not many people who are live. Maybe. I feel um, like around now is when everybody. Katsune uh, you, you could you could raid Katsune Niku, who is doing a um a garbage green hardcore Nuzlocke. Alright. Uh, if you have anybody, you could just like send their name to me in chat or through DM or anything, and I'll just. Do the command because I can't be bothered to find sure, myself because I'm just, lazy. I put them right here for you. Yeah. Um, Pokemon, you should know by now that I don't trust your raid um, suggestions because they're mostly always VTubers and I don't raid VTubers because I don't really do that. Um, no. What's wrong with VTubers? I don't know, it just, you know, nothing wrong with them, just, I don't really get it, if you, if you understand. Like, there's nothing wrong with it, I just I, don't I really not. get it. It's just kind of a person who has an avatar instead of a webcam. Yeah, I understand that, but, meh. Um, just check Pokemons as well. You do you, but it's much harder to find people who are streaming if you're, uh, not including, like, an entire group of people, which is also about 70% of Twitch. True. I could always just give in, you know. Fair enough. Because I do like to try and, like, do a variety of different, like, um, communities as well. And Pokemon's always suggesting VTubers. So that's why I don't really go with Pokemon's that much. Uh, 
Because you're new, I'll go with you. Your idea. Purely because you're new. Alright. So, let me just do something really quick. Do that. Let's go. I'm struggling a bit. There we go. Let me just check. Um, it's the one that I said. I did. Well. Alright, so. Um, we're gonna go with that. So make sure you're ready to raid, and um, I will hopefully see you all on Tuesday. All right. Um, bye.